You know that moment when a friend will be like, Dude, do you know how much whiskey makes per show? How much? 50 million lira. Really? Nah, it's all lies. What? Yeah, people just estimate figures based on what they think. But when the actual truth is that some Nigerian artists don't even make up to 500k. And that is why in this video, I'm going to be going through exactly how much Nigerian musicians make per show. Stay tuned. Hey there guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Before we go into anything serious, let's go through a little bit of the formalities. You guys know I always do this now, right? Anyway, hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell icon so you get notified every single time I drop a new banger video on this channel. And also guys, do me a favor and smash that like button. Smash that like button real hard guys. Even if you don't do it for me, at least do it for the dogs. Smash that like button guys. Oh. To, to do it for the dog. Well, enough of that already. I assume you guys have conscience and you guys can't do the right thing. So, just like it. Okay, so now, guys, the big question of the day How much do Nigerian musicians actually make per show? Well, a lot of people get confused due to the fact that most of these artists live very expensive lives. So with that fact, they feel it is reasonable to believe that they actually get paid enough money from shows or events to be able to actually afford that lifestyle. But in real life, that is not exactly how it is. Most times, the money they spend on the making of a song from the initial recording to the music video production and marketing is way more than they make from two to three shows in a week. Then how the hell did they afford this lifestyle, you may ask? Well, the various opportunities that come alongside being a famous musician is quite infinite. Don't know if you've heard of anything called endorsement deals well that's one of the game changers for almost any musician but before we go into all that let me give you guys a full breakdown of how much nigerian musicians actually make okay so before an artist is hired to perform the client has to meet with the artist and his manager to discuss and negotiate prices just so you know there isn't any fixed price for any artist like all these other blogs will be claiming it to be they only have price ranges in which they are booked or hired. An artist can decide to call out any amount he wants, doesn't mean that the client will pay. There are actually some factors that determine how much a client is willing to pay for an artist. If the current demand for an artist by the public is very low, maybe due to the fact that the artist hasn't released any new songs in a very long time or doesn't have any hit songs or probably still even an upcoming artist, then definitely they are going to be negotiating around 200k to a million naira, which is quite reasonable because no show host is going to pay 5 million naira to an artist that hasn't released any new songs in the past 2 years. Except for when maybe this other factor is in play, which is their fame level. We all know that not all the artists in the music industry are in the same level when it comes to exposure and fame. Definitely, some are more popular than the others which in this sense affects how much they get paid but not in the way you are thinking it to be though most people think that because an artist has over 20 million fans on instagram or facebook then the artist is probably bagging around 20 to 30 million naira per show but no that's not actually how the fame affects their prices how it affects their pricing is in relation to how much exposure being really famous gets them because with more exposure they get more public demands which in return leads to more show gigs and when an artist starts to get multiple gigs the price of that artist tends to increase because at that point, every show host wants to have that particular artist on their show. That is why artists like Whiskey and Davido get paid around 5 million naira to over 10 million naira per show. Another factor that affects this price is what I like to call trend. You know, the number one rule for any artist in the music industry today is to stay trending. Why? Because staying on top of the trend to them means they get more exposure. And with more exposure, just like I said earlier on, means that they get more gigs, which in another sense means more money. That is why most times when artists can no longer produce hit songs, they turn to other means like blogging, acting, just so they could retain their fame. Which is why there is always new stories surfacing every single day on the internet about most of all these artists. Some are true and some are lies. Just like I said, it is all for the trend. Another thing I want you guys to know is that an upcoming artist that is currently trending could actually get paid as high as an artist that has gained quite a number of fame all because the artist is trending so within that period of time the price of the artist increases drastically these are basically the three factors that determines how much a nigerian artist actually gets paid per show it is quite different from those abroad because they have booking agencies who deal directly with the clients on behalf of the artist they do all the negotiations and scheduling so basically theirs is more refined unlike in nigeria where you have to make a call to their manager to fix meetings so you guys could discuss and negotiate prices well it is what it is it is what it is <laughs> Here is a precise estimation of how much Nigerian musicians actually make.
I know a lot of you guys will disagree with me now that you've seen how much they actually earn compared to how much they spend on cars, jets, and all that. Yeah, I know it doesn't add up, but like I told you guys earlier on, there are several other incentives that come alongside being a musician, and show money happens to be one of the most common of them all. I'm just gonna go through some of these incentives so that you guys could actually see how much these musicians actually make. Going on music tours is one of the ways these musicians actually rack up this money. Be it a 6 day or 1 day tour, the pay is quite huge compared to single shows. It ranges from 30 million naira to over 75 million naira as the case may be. And the good thing about this one is that sometimes the artists actually get paid up front. Another way they make money is by selling merchandise, that is, their own personal product. For example, t-shirts, socks, shoes, and so on. Example of such artists in Nigeria. We all know that Whiskey launched his own clothing line in collaboration with Nike in May 2018, and it has been bringing in a lot of money since then. As a matter of fact, he sold out within 10 minutes of the initial release, which is crazy, because he sold just one of the jersey for 100 hero plus. So now imagine how much he made selling out to over a thousand plus fans in just 10 minutes. That is a whooping 100,000 hero, which if you should converted to naira is around 49 million naira in just 10 minutes well that's pretty much it for that another way these guys make money is by hosting their own shows you see most nigerian artists are now hosting their own shows like olis life in concert with whiskey davido and so on so now imagine how much they make from over 200,000 people in just one night Hmm. Even if the show is just for a thousand naira only, that's still a whooping 200 mil on the spot. Not to now talk of the money coming in from the different sponsors and all that. And besides that, some shows still even have different levels like regulars, VIP, VVIPs, tables and so on like that. And I'm sure we all know that the prices of these things changes as we go up the chain. Like for most cases, tables cost up to a million naira or more. So I want you guys to do the calculations yourself. See how much just 5 tables pays out. To wrap this up, basically, this is one method that makes them billionaires. I guess you guys can see the picture now. Moving on to the next one which definitely is the last one i'm gonna be talking about in this video endorsement deals this is one of the best incentives most musicians start to enjoy even in their early stage of becoming famous for those of you that don't know what it means when people say an artist just got an endorsement deal well it basically means the artist has been endorsed by a particular brand to recommend or suggest the brand's products or services to their fans so you could literally say that the artist is getting paid to advertise for the brand regardless of whether they make profits or not but most times it's a win-win situation the artist gets paid and the company gets the exact exposure they need that is why endorsements are now becoming more common in nigeria today spreading across the entire entertainment industry and not just the music segment alone the pay is quite huge too ranging from a millionaire to as high as a billionaire depending on the artist and the time frame of the contract if you recall whiskey got paid about three million dollars for an endorsement deal with uba bank some time ago and if you should check that in naira it is about a billion naira plus and him having that deal didn't mean he didn't have any other deal or couldn't accept any other one it's just crazy how much these guys make from all this in general well that is how they are able to afford this luxurious lifestyle so guys that's about it for this video hope you guys learned a lot if this video inspired you in any way or motivated you to want to venture into the nigerian music industry well feel free to jump down in the comment section and let me know what you think because as for me counting on this money has made me realize that i need to make money i really do because man Sakba is real <laughs> anyways let's not forget before you guys go do me a favor and click on the link in the description box and go over to my new instagram page and follow me there my old account got hacked so i created a new one and i'm trying to get it up so guys please follow me also give a like on this video if you enjoyed it and hit that subscribe button to subscribe to this youtube channel and i will see you guys next time peace out